Hello guys, we are Voivod here in our beautiful rehearsal place. We celebrate this year uh, our 35th, 35th anniversary and we have a new album coming up called Awake. create a, a whole story with eight songs, you know, so they're interrelated. Uh, it was quite a job to do. Um, so this, the story itself, it's a bit like a, there's a big discovery and from that discovery, the world, the world's gonna change because uh, uh, there's, a, there's some facts that it's uh, undeniable. And from that point on, the world starts to change really fast and there's conflicts and chaos and this and that and then at the end um, sort of like humanity reach uh, another state of mind you know or the, they must uh, humanity must improve uh, their the way they're thinking and, and it's, a, it's a grow up thing for the evolution and and then it finished in space with you know more spiritual ending and uh, with, uh, with violence. <laughs> the mu uh, music goes with that too. It's very complex music, very progressive, uh, with the punk and metal and trash uh, colors, which uh, uh, was always part of Voivod, but with a lot of intricate and odd, you know, uh, very rich harmonies, uh, complementary parts between uh, all the instruments, including vocals and a lot of late motives from song to song which are transformed or hidden and re reused from one song to another so it's uh, it, it's not the kind of album you'll, you'll listen one, to once and you'll catch everything you have to to listen to it as a journey from the first song to the, to the end but as well you have to listen to it many a times, few times and, before and discover new things all the time it's, it's a it's a journey it's many journeys <laughs> talked about uh, Chernobyl back, back then and now it can be Fukushima or ozone layer back then now it's like global uh, warming and so there's always uh, inspiring stuff for uh, for us to uh, talk about um, it's uh, it's just that it's more um, up to date I would say with what's going on now but it's always in sort of a sci-fi futuristic uh, context and uh, but we, we do talk a lot about uh, problems happening Mm -hmm. on this planet. Well, history repeats itself, so it's, it's always feeding us. You know? yeah. So this time around, it's, it's different because it's a concept album, so uh, it's a bit different than a you know usual record. You know, we have to think ahead of things. You know, it's like from the first song that goes into the second, and then almost starting like really writing the stuff. I had ideas and everything, but. I really started to compile all those ideas when the pacing of the album was determined. So, song one, two, three, four, and then I start to create the story, which is a different way uh, than if we would do like just a record, let's say. And song after yeah, another. song, yeah. It, it, it turns out it's a lot of work to do a concept <laughs> album. And the task, the task was uh, pretty amazing. Uh, to we and uh, the engineer Francis, uh, they worked a lot on uh, making everything into a cohesive uh, product. You know? it's, uh, it's, uh, it's like a long trip, the album. But uh, it was um, everybody, everybody got really involved, and uh, it, it, we worked probably for about two years, I guess, mm -hmm. uh, pretty much nonstop between two, even on tour mm -hmm. in the tour bus. We uh, we worked on the album. And, so uh, finally, it's all completed uh, and uh, coming out uh, for the Euro tour in the fall. Yeah, I, I think Snake's inspired a lot by the music 
yeah. uh, for the melodies, but also the melodies brings the subject. Exactly. And then the music inspire him and through, throughout the, his influence about the actuality or you know what's going on in the world. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a process, you know. You don't come with the, the you know phrases like that just Sometimes it's the music itself that's going to put you in a mood, you know. Hey, that 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 would be like kind of like a, if the music inspired or like a sadness, let's say. Well, you know, it would be lyrics going of that direction, you know, because it's and if it's like a really punchy and heavy, yeah, something's going on there, you know. So I I really follow the music and. Uh, I create my own story in my head, and I see images, and and then I start putting words in different places to kind of like build up uh, sections, and from that point, you know, I I, uh, I write stuff or get inspired by the news or whatever, okay. and then I add it to it, but it has to be like a. It's, it's, it's a long way, it's a long process, you know, yeah. it, it doesn't come like that. And sometimes I have, a, or, or sometimes it's the opposite, it's a, it's a melody that I'm going to do here while we rehearse, and, and then uh, we, we would go like, hey, don't forget this, you know, and, uh, <laughs> and I started <laughs> starting uh, something with the melody I just created yeah. on the spot. We, we had some experience from uh, Dimension Hatras uh, 30 years ago as a concept album and we knew that it was uh, like a lot of work to bring back some riffs but we arranged differently and so, and so on and so on. Um, I, think, uh, I think that uh, it, if anything it might be a bit easier to put, it, put the puzzle together nowadays because of software. Uh, Photos and back then, uh, if you wanted to have a reverse effect, we had to cut the tape and with a yeah. razor blade yeah. and reverse it. Nowadays, it's touchy thing. Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> but it, but uh, it doesn't mean that it's uh, not a lot of work. It's uh, it was. Uh, <coughs> um, it's only more options. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah. It's yeah. actually yeah. You're right. It's yeah. a bit like using Photoshop with the magnifier. You know, at the end, you you, you have to stop using it because. You just go crazy and spend hours on one tiny detail that nobody's gonna see. When you got too many options, yeah, it's yeah. like uh, we developed a, a method, so to speak, together, playing together for many years and writing the EP, and then for the album we already had this chemistry and this way of working, which was uh, working great. So yeah. it has been a, a good journey just to write the album was an amazing time mm -hmm. to spend together and and find our way through, through the song and the structures and everything. And that in itself is, is very enriching and, and, and yeah, fa yeah. a fantastic uh, journey. Uh, and, and once it's done, you go you know like, oh, no, it's over. Well, it's over. <laughs> <laughs> in town came and then after uh, at the end we played a motorhead song and they all started their bikes uh, while we we're playing and we we can hear it on the very first demo the, the live demo we released in 83 you can hear the bikers uh, starting their bikes <laughs> at the end of the show <laughs> we uh, we used to share a jam space with a biker and he had many friends and so uh, they all showed up at our, at our very first show but then again my grandmother was there too so <laughs> <laughs> 